DC to be back. DC to be back. Oh, 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 oh. What's up, everybody? It's your favorite show, favorite show, Get a Bucket. I'm your host, Train as usual. Hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful day. And as you can see, we got my girl Naomi on the screen now. Naomi, how's everything with you? Hello, I'm doing great. Glad to be here. Thanks for having me. Appreciate you, appreciate you. I got to say, that is the cleanest background I have seen on the screen <laughs> thus far outside of mine. Like, that is smooth, bro. Like, hey, I might have to take care of some adult business here and... I appreciate you for sharing a little time. I appreciate you. So look, we're going to talk about the storm for the WNBA 2023 predictions, right? Um, a whole new squad now. You know what I mean? And I, I wanted to talk about them because I know you are, I know you're a Sue Bird fan. I know you're a Brandon Stewie fan. You know what I mean? So based on this team, right? And, I, and, and let's do it according to like everybody wants to talk about the Liberty and Aces, and I think it's not just a, a two-team lead right this year. Um, I the don't think the spread out. I do yeah. not see a team right now that is going to compete with uh, with Las Vegas, but it'll be it should be even across the board elsewhere, in my opinion. I I I, I kind of disagree with you, but um, that's another video for another day. I'm assuming, but just know. There are a couple teams that can beat both the Aces and the Liberty. Again, there are some teams out there that can beat those two. Okay. It's just not going to be the Storm, though. So, what would be um, the starting five based on your assessment? Blue Lloyd, Kia Nurse, scroll down some. That, no, that's the, whole, that's the whole list. That's the whole list. Oh, Turner. Keanu Nurse, no, not Turner. Either Keanu or Turner. Jasmine Walker, and then I don't know enough about the rest. A big player, so probably definitely either the six five or the six sixer. Whoever's the better between them. Okay, now why it's do you solid, say Jasmine? It's a sol- it looks like a solid squad though. Why do you go Jasmine Walker in the starting lineup out of curiosity? She's big enough to play a forward. I, I don't know too much about her game, but I feel like you okay. know, someone you have some height defensive wise, you have someone who's potentially another scoring threat. She's not clogging up the lane and she's able to be out on the perimeter or on the uh, you know, from mid range. You know, okay. you know, you have your two small guards in there already. I think those, I think the one, two, and three are always the most interchangeable. You're not going to, you know, unless you have a dynamic post player, those are typically, you just have to be creative with what you have. Right. So I went, I, I went a little different. I went a little different. I started off with Sammy Whitcomb, uh, Jewel Lloyd, Kia Nurse, Eddie Magabor, and um, Mercedes Russell. So, I got six six, six four. Oh, yeah, I'm like, what is that? What? What is that in the background? Are you, are you drinking something? No idea. I don't know. If that's mine or yours. Now, uh, just you know, just for the record, for the record, right? We were talking about before the technical difficulties. Um, we were talking about the storm. We were talking about the storm, but you yeah. brought to my attention that you know you you said you looked at, at the Dallas Wings. Let me tell you that Dallas squad. That Dallas squad. They got some dogs in their team. They have like they just have like a couple of core big name players on their squad. And then they have the a couple of what? Of like of big names on their team. Like I don't even know. I don't know if they all play at once. I haven't seen them play together. But and then what they're bringing in on top of that. So look, like, I'm about to say let, let me let me just like I'm 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 pulling up the roster right now for the people so that way they can see it. Okay. So, so right now off the yeah. So off the break we got and this is my starting five. 
Arike, Diamond, yes. Natasha. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and highlight my starting five now. You know what I mean? And then, um, where? Is, I was about to say, uh, where? Oh, Sato. There we go. And then Tierra McCallum. Or Tierra, yeah. Tierra yeah, I was about to say Tierra McCallum. Now the bench. I, I think I think I think Tierra wins that lineup. I think I think Tierra wins that one. Now the bench for me, it's going to be interesting what uh, Crystal and Kalani do, but. Locke and Charlie, though, they have tremendous potential. They they were they they got drafted not too long ago. One and two, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so I I, I got to see what they do. And the, the, the craziest thing is they have not gotten enough playing time. And I think with this team, they actually could get some playing time, some valuable experience. Sato Sabali's health factor is 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 questionable for me too because she has had an injury riddled career thus up to this point. So they got a lot of they got a lot of things to work with on this team though. I was telling my uh, boy Devin they're going to be pretty solid. They could remind me of the Pistons team in o, um in 04 when they beat the Lakers and that following season right and that following season they actually could have gotten Carmelo Anthony and it's funny because this season. They are really positioned nicely in the draft. They have three of the top 11 picks. So when you factor all of that in too, the wings are looking pretty nice. Like I like that's why I tell people they can rival the Liberty or the Aces. It's not just a two team league right now. That's where is that when I could be way off. That's, is that before or after when Chauncey That's when we had played? Yeah, that's when Chauncey Below was on the team. And they beat okay. Carl Malone and Gary Payton when we acquired them on okay. the uh, on the Lakers. Okay, I just had to make sure. <laughs> and the re and the re and again the reason why I say the Pistons, uh, Arike and Chauncey that could or could not be a fair comparison. Um, I, I I think Natasha Howard could give me Rasheed Wallace like capabilities. You know what I'm saying? That stretch four, not a girthy type big, but enough girth to. Man, the four spot down here, McCowan. I don't necessarily want to say Ben Wallace, but Ben Wallace had to go up against Shaq, and you know you got to go up against John Quayle or Asia Wilson potentially. So I, I'm giving her that comparison. Exactly, like, big body. Now Ben was undersized, but you know for position sake, we're gonna slide it to it for this one. Uh, Sato Sabali, lanky like Tayshawn Prince. Um, so you know, yep, good point. So. So again, I, there, there's some similar, and then Diamond the Shields, Rip Hamilton. I think Diamond the Shields really can come off the screen and hit that mid range quite nicely. That's so, what I'm thinking about that. So I'm thinking there's the Pistons so is a nice scores. comparison. Exactly. They got so many scores in their front line, bitch, too, because you got to think about who they're bringing in. They're bringing in that uh, Zerg Ice girl. Potentially, potentially, potentially. Know, we'll see how that will be. How it's Jake. Way the, the way the mock goes, the way the mock goes right now, they got they got two guards coming in within the first round. If I'm yeah. if I looked at it correctly, that's that's a that's if that coach is creative and plays that well, that's a, that's a great that's a lot of buckets right there. I forget the forward. other. There were there were a couple forwards that the Wings could actually draft because again they're getting the number three pick and the number five pick. And then they're getting right. the number eleven pick, so they could draft right. two forwards like if they really want to. And then I don't know what and the eleven pick is. It'd be a big, I think, from what I saw in the mock. That girl, she's like six. On the eleven, she's, she's coming from, she's coming from uh, Iowa State. She's six six. Another big. Oh, player. I know you. I know who you're talking about. They got Suarez going to the Mystics, which I like. Yes. Yeah, Suarez, I like going to the Mystics, and then they got jo uh, Jordan Horston. They, they have her going to the wings out of uh, Tennessee. That's it. That's it. It's a girl from Tennessee. Okay. That's yeah. crazy. She, she's also another diamond diamond type of, you know, a good three mid-range. I'm pretty sure she can shoot from behind the arc, too, but I don't want to misspeak. Yeah, that's a crazy squad, but... I think she was respectable. I got to check, though. <laughs> I, I, no, I'm saying, I, 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 I wouldn't. I saw, I saw the highlights. And I got to say, I like the fact that they were bringing her in because I think she's someone who can learn after Diamond the Shield. She gives me that type of that type of vibe. Like her game seems to be comparable. So I think that's somebody who could actually mentor her. So we're that's talking nice about for the future, too. 
Yeah, exactly. Like someone to build off of. So I, I like the wings this year. I really do. And again, that's not biased. Um, that's genuine like appreciation for the wings because yeah. they're looking pretty scary. Like, like this it. starting like five it. is solid as hell. Solid. I like, it. I like it for sure. I'm good at it. Them, uh, we can skip next to you mentioned the uh, Minnesota. I think you're right on that one too. With just with just if Diamond goes how she goes, with just Diamond coming in, I think I think you, that's a you 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 think something you think you, you whoa you think something solid out in Minnesota or you think they Re, pull up the roster. Let me see. I'm pretty certain when I was skimming it over, I was like, okay. Depending on how how it meshes together, I got them and one other squad that I want to that I want to throw out there that I'm the, the fever. I God damn, yeah. <laughs> you want to go down all the teams? I love it. All right, so hold on, let me pull them up real quick. Um. always with it always about it i hope people enjoy the the conversation and have similar or maybe even opposing views and also uh we didn't like and i didn't inherently or without knowing disrespect any player because you know it is what it is is. It, it is what it is if so um you know that just means they got to change your opinion it is what it is they they can treat it with a grain of salt oh i did not know you guys were still here as, as, as you can see we're at the back end of the show no pun intended but look hope you all enjoyed it and before you go Please subscribe to the YouTube channel, follow the IG account, share the content to anybody who's anybody, and most importantly, leave your thoughts and comments below. But I gotta go back and play Buddy in 2K, so let me unmute him real quick. Excuse me. Hey, boss, I'm back. Nah, you better catch this word. You know we get buckets around here, Pip.